What up, peeps? It's Axe with Nectar Food. We're going to go ahead and do a review today. And today, the thing we're going to feature is Clementine Live Resin from Standing Akimbo. Uh, yeah, we did a review. We just about pushed out a review just recently from Standing Akimbo. We actually did a big run. So there's going to be a couple reviews here coming through from different products from this dispensary. So... Uh, this is actually the suspensory that I, Axe from Nectarfeed, am signed over to as well. So uh, we'll continue to uh, review products from them for a while now. Uh, we also go to a couple places in the springs, but as you may have noticed from our past reviews, we have been going to Denver a lot more because the pricing is a lot more competitive and uh, dispensaries we usually shop at here just can't seem to... Uh, keep enough of the type of product that we like in stock. So um, that's why we've been branching out a lot and visiting other places. So this Clementine Live Resin that we picked up here is pretty spectacular. Uh, tastes and smells amazing. So we're going to go dab it for you guys and uh, talk about it a little bit. But the only problem I have is that the company it's from uh, has really um, poor art direction, I'll say. <laughs> Uh, I don't know where the logo is here. Um, we've got a bunch of text and the text in the bottom is on a different, is uh, different from the text on the top. The text on the top around the cap is upside down and then the text on the top is just that, a bunch of text. I don't see a logo here. Uh, so I'm not too sure what the company is. Um, there's this thing that says VVS Melee, and I do see something that says DB, very small on the bottom here. So, uh, heads up, if you're that company and you see this, I'm an art director, I can give you a little help if you want a little bit of, uh, graphics, uh, direction there. But, um, a little less text, a little bit more art, uh, would go a lot, a long ways to helping, uh, show your brand off anyway. So without further ado, Clementine Live Resin from who knows who, I don't know, the company, uh, from Standing Akimbo Medical Dispensary in Denver. Let's see here, we got some sauce and we got some diamonds. This looks really, really good. It's uh, uh, pretty much um, the perfect ratio of terps to diamonds. So good job, um, whoever you are that made this Live Resin. <laughs> VVS Melee, I don't know, I never heard of that before. I, that's why initially I didn't say that was the company because it just kind of seemed kind of weird. But maybe that is them. Oh boy! Wow! Yeah, baby, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, that's the good live resin, the good Clementine. Yeah, so for those who may be new to the strain or might not be that familiar with it, Clementine is a sativa hybrid. They do tend to label it as a hybrid, but it is sativa, very sativa. Leafly has it as a red. Now, what's so special about Clementine? The taste. The Clementine tastes like the name uh, oranges, Clementine oranges. It's very orangey. Orangey is probably one of the orangiest um, strains that you can find. In fact, that's why it's our favorite. It's why Concentrate Queen, sorry about that, Concentrate Queen and I chase it around the springs because uh, it's it's uh, one of these strains that the terpene profile is so strong that the flavor is just uh, phenomenal. Phenomenal. It's always this really strong citrus flavor and then clementine also makes you feel real good it's an uplifting creative euphoric energetic strain so you puff down on it and you don't get tired right away instead you get kind of peppy uh not the way green crack is but it gives you a nice little oomph um i really like it for my first smoke of the day and also for my second smoke of the day usually will be clementine it's also really nice too because it um it, it makes the scent in your nose like when you go outside uh, the terpenes stick with you and so then everything smells like citrus like the air smells almost like somebody keeps spraying like some kind of orange citrus spray around you or something right you just the wind blows and 
Oh, you can smell is oranges. It's this really cool effect. Uh, it also happens with tangy, for those of you who might not have smoked it or might be familiar with it. Uh, when you smoke tangy, it does a very similar thing. It makes it so that everywhere you go outside, all you can smell is oranges and citrus. It's pretty nice. So yeah, this is really good stuff. The um, Like I said, I really like the ratio of terps to diamonds. The Terps, uh, oh yeah, here, let me show you here so you guys can see, there you go, it, there it is, a little bit. Uh, yeah, it's a really nice ratio of Terps and Diamonds here, and there you go. And uh, so yeah, pretty much for every hit you get that nice Terpy flavor, uh, but you're also still getting a good buzz because there's just enough Diamonds to do the job. So, very nice, gotta say, very nice. Oh man, wow, look at that. Oh yeah, so terpy. So orangey, wow. So delicious. So yeah, uh, t uh, by the way, uh, Clementine is the magic combination of tangy, which is amazing strain, very orangey. That's how it gets so orangey. Crossed with lemon skunk. So this is what gives you the really good um, like funk there's a there's a funk that happens with clementine that a lot of other orange strains don't have and that's from the lemon skunk the lemon skunk brings in some lemon some of that skunky funkiness and you add that to the uh that citrus orange that comes from tangy and it's just boom it's amazing that's one of the things that uh, draw, draw, uh, draw us to Clementine in the first place. First time we smoked it and smelt it was, it wasn't just the citrus, because you can get that with orange soda and tangy and a couple other things, but it was that funk, that funk that's just like, oh my goodness, what is going on here? I don't understand. So um, yeah, <laughs> Clementine, live resin from Stanny Akimbo in this maybe VVS melee, uh, company, hard to tell, but uh, really good, really terpy, really diamondy. And also, I gotta say, um, thanks again to Standing of Kembo. Uh, we went shopping there, and they're cool. They're just super cool. They let us sign over. Uh, we got good deals. Like I said in the last review, I came home with an ounce of live resin for under $500. Uh, and everything was really good the stuff that we really like so um, once again you can find stuff like mimosa and clementine and uh, the insane in the membrane that's one of those ones they are keeping stocked and that is a tasty tasty strain we reviewed that last time so uh, yeah if you like learning about uh, where the drops are in the Den Denver area now in the springs and uh, those concentrate reviews you want to know where that quality is and where the flavor is hey like and subscribe down there at the little bottom in the corner there on YouTube and check us out at Instagram nectar feed 420 Facebook nectar feed and uh, you guys per usual <laughs> have a good one Thank <laughs> you.